hey Joe, Bebot, 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 Filipino. Today, yeah, Nez and now uh, yeah, is I'm Ho, and we have Noel and Johan as always. Let's go. Yeah, nah, there's too much going on. <laughs> like I think. Oh, even with cause. Come on. Yeah, but I'm, I'm a fan. But if it's shit, I don't want it. <laughs> like. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you got to force it. <laughs> no. <laughs> Fan, all fans force. Fan force like an oven. Um, that, yeah, there's just way too much going on. Like, uh, it's, it's, it looks like if you like you, if, you, if you collab like with like 20 different people, all of them have to have their logo on the thing. It just looks like that. Like, um, there's way too much going on. It looks like it's dirty. <laughs> like, uh. I don't know. Maybe it's that Travis Scott thing. He has to have it look mm. distressed and like... I don't know, it's like he just like, walked from the desert. Yeah. yeah. And it's like, and you need just dust. There's just <laughs> yeah. dust on you. And you, <laughs> I'm thirsty. You look thirsty all the time. Uh, and the t-shirt's like, it's got that, I don't know, they, they really stretched that cause thing and stuff. Like, um, yeah, it, just, it just looks really messy. Like, a, I don't know what's supposed to be, like a rib cage or something there. I don't know. I, I honestly, I don't really like the fragment logo. Um, maybe someone mm. will shit on me for that. I started <laughs> someone who shit on us for something else like two episodes ago for not knowing something and I was like I'm looking at this on face value so um but yeah it looked really just just I don't know it just looks really shit to me I don't know maybe there's some other hidden meaning that I don't know but on the surface level it just doesn't look that great so yeah right. um yeah nah. uh yeah nah as well um not a big varsity jacket person anyway and the fact that there's too much stuff on it um as Noel said, uh, yeah, just not a big fan of it. Um, the only thing I might consider is maybe the cause t-shirt, just a t-shirt, because there's no, it's not too much for me. Um, but the the yeah, there's less on it. But the sweater just looks like an old painter's jumper. You know what I mean? Like somebody you, does you spilled bleach on it. <laughs> yeah, or like uh, you know the interior painters, like they do houses and yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It just yeah, looks like yeah, that, yeah, or like yeah. a yeah, you know, or a plasterer. Looks like he it's meant to be all gray and then that's what he used to paint and then it became like that um yeah, yeah. it just looks really old and yeah i don't know or like um what's that tattoo brand again um oh like a, uh like affliction or ed, something ed, ed, ed hardy ed, ed hardy and affliction oh, ed hardy. And yeah, 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 the yeah. Affliction too much brand. going on uh, yeah. yeah it's too much um but yeah maybe maybe the t-shirt um, I, that's probably the only thing I'd I'd get, but overall it's a you know. Yeah, I'm a yeah. No, I think that's too much going on for me. But uh, with the jacket, I would consider if you didn't have <clears throat> um, so much on front and back. Mm. <laughs> Normally, I think it's like um, the back. Maybe they have something and a small thing on the front, but this is like front and back. But I don't mind so much the distressed look and stuff. And I like varsity jackets, but I think for me this is too much going on. So. Um, yeah, enough for me. Hey, Joe. Bebot, 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 Filipino. Got a nah, yeah, this man. Um, nah, yeah. It's, it's like uh, Michael Jackson. Is it Rock With You? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah it looks uh, like yeah. that. Yeah. yeah. Um, that vibe. Yeah. Um, you got to, fellow Filipino. You just have to copy him, don't you? <laughs> uh, 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 yeah, I like his, I see, his see-through uh, T-shirt. He's underneath the lacy the lace yeah, yeah. a barong yeah. type for all those yeah. filipinos looks like a barong um is it, is it, is it itchy as well it's probably, <laughs> it's probably really itchy but um no nah, like he's like obviously he can pull it off um obviously yeah. I, I probably couldn't do that so <laughs> but um adna yeah just because he was brave enough to to do that and he actually pulled it off for me anyway so um no yeah you rate it? Oh, I rate it all right. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'd say not yet. It's for lols. <laughs> it's just like imagine, like you gotta have fun with. It. Honestly, like why would you want to do something boring when you're going to like draft night? Just gotta be loud and proud about it. It's not. It's gonna be like maybe. What if you, are, you end up being shit? At least you'd be remembered that you wore something crazy. <laughs> so, I mean, uh, and also like I know I'm, I'm not Filipino, but like um, uh, if you're if you're Asian, I'd be like hey. <laughs> You're my mate. Let's go. <laughs> Automatic. <Hey. laughs> Automatic. Let's go. Um, but like, uh, yeah, yeah. Just, just for fun. I don't know what's the. I can't zoom in on the the cut to chain. Is it like a a four? It's a number four. Yeah, it's a number four. Mm. Yeah, it's um, his number. I think I'm changing my number. All oh, right. Well, yeah. <laughs> changing my number. It's a four. Actually, <laughs> it was number four, four, by the way. Actually, it used to be number four. 
It's fun. Oh. Uh, cool. I just uh, returned to four. Uh, but yeah, know. it's, it's just... <laughs> the flares. I haven't worn one of the, a pair of those in ages. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder what his shoes are. He's, he's sponsored by Adidas, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah, he's yeah. Adidas. Yeah. It's not easy. It doesn't look like easy. I don't know. Can't, I can't find it. I thought. I thought. Um, he would carry on with the with the glitter sparkling stuff. with like a. He should have worn those know. disco stew shoes with the, the aquarium with inside. Aquarium. <laughs> with a fish, <laughs> dead fish inside. Your fish are dead. Yeah, I know. I can't get them out of there. Not yet. I mean, it's, um, yeah, like you said, if you, uh, you know, why 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 wear something boring like it's draft night? Everyone tries to do something different and. I think at the moment, um, everyone's wearing obviously like the loafers and that sort of stuff, which is now common. It used to be different, but now it's common. So I think this guy has just um, stepped it up another another level. So um, that was, yeah, I actually like I, li I actually like it. Um, everything actually, like I'd, I'd try and <laughs> like that. I don't think I can pull it off because I can't put it in my hair, but yeah, I think it's cool. I think it's really, really cool. I'm going to say, nah, yeah, just because um, I've always liked Y3, and um, I've always wanted to try this 4D cushioning. Mm. I've always um, wanted. I've been looking to get 4D shoes for a while, actually. Same. Same. With the, same. I just uh, want to know because I just um, I just bought another pair of um, Ultra Boost again. Yeah. Um, and I've always loved the cushioning on the Adidas runners. So I know these are probably like seven hundred dollars or whatever it is, but. Um, I've always liked the style of Y3. Well, and, how you know, much was the original 4D? I mean, because I brought that out, um, the original one. It oh, was, it was it still ridiculous. Like it was like nearly $400. 400? Yeah. yeah, $400. I think it was on sale recently at Adidas for like um, 249 yeah. It was on sale. On sale. And yeah. like Ultra Boost were on sale for like 150 yeah, you know so what I mean? Not, so, yeah. yeah, but um, yeah, Y3 has always been a fan, but just, yeah, just can't justify the price of it but these looks really this look really cool for me um this mm. is easy now yeah no yeah um i'm actually like looking to get new runners because yeah i've been using ultra boost for a while for mm. running um and i just feel like to, i just want something else to switch it up with um i do have like other runners like nike ones to use to run but i always end up going back to the ultra boost they're just so much better but um yeah, yeah i just want to find something that's on the similar like comfort level and um, uh, yeah, that's why I'm interested in uh, the four Ds. But man, this is game changer, man. I might have to force these. <laughs> I, might, I was, I really want to like just go on another browser and just have a look at these and see if I can get them. But obviously, I probably couldn't because they're probably gone already. But um, this is not. Nah, yeah, I just like everything about it. Uh, I like the modular design. I like that. I actually quite like the mid top. It reminds me of like um, kind of like a the Presto type thing or like there's some Gore-Tex shoes that I've seen that are kind of oh, like yeah. that. Uh, it would be even better if they said Gore-Tex, <laughs> I can run around in the rain <laughs> in it. Mm. Um, I actually want to know how it feels. Like, does it, is it pretty secure when you put the your feet in there? Like you put in the, looks like a, like a booty thing that makes it the mid top when you slide it in. And does it get like, like because of my issues, does it get really hot in there? Oh, I assume not if they designed it right. It should be well ventilated. Um, yeah, but not yet because it looks interesting. Like, I don't know what the 4D thing feels like. Um, is that the 3D printed thing? Yeah. Is that the one that they 3D print? Um, yeah. Uh, I'm curious about that. But yeah, this is like their luxury brand, I guess. But yeah, no, yeah, it just looks fun. I, I, don't, I don't know if I'll, I, I don't need to run in these. <laughs> I just wear them around. Um, I would actually prefer the mid the mid top thing to the, the low cut. The future is now, guys. It's here. It's right here. <laughs> it's 4D, man. Don't worry about 3D. It's 4D. The future is 4D. <laughs> it goes in, it, you can go through time in these. Yeah. <laughs> On that note, uh, that wraps up our top three releases for this week. If you love our content, please give us a like and subscribe to our channel. Um, if you're watching this on IGTV, show us some love and follow us if you haven't already. Appreciate your time today, guys. So please join us again next week for another segment of Yena. Bye for now. Peace. Bye.